Hey everybody, it's Will. It's Amanda. Uh, we're playing some more of The Inner World. Last time we just finished up chapter one, Ooh. and we've moved on. Exciting to see what's waiting for us in the root forest. The root forest, which I'm sure is where they make root beer. Yeah, that seems legit to me. Delicious. For sure. Let's get some. <laughs> Let's get that root beer. What exactly are we looking for? Ice cream, hopefully. My father <laughs> talked about the root forest in the film. Did you not listen? I was thinking about ice cream. Well, I was slightly distracted by the screaming aspersions and the basilis. Oh, yeah, that was... That's true that happened. That was distracting. The place where the film was made has to be somewhere here in the forest. Hmm. But the root forest is huge. Full of roots. And this guy. Man. This dude's not... And scary. Friendly. We have to start somewhere. Don't you want to know the secret behind the petrified flute noses? What? Mm. Well, of course. Let's go. Does she not well, know okay. I, I about his say that. Um, special well, then, let's go. talent? What's, which talent? Stop. There's a trap there. His well, nose. Oh, yeah. I knew that. I just wanted to. Well, he showed yeah, her right, the nose that he had. Oh no, she knows. She knows. I'm going to find another way into the forest. You stay here. Act petrified. And above all, don't touch anything. Alternatively, touch everything. Touch everything. I couldn't handle this trap by myself. He's he got cocky going from like living in a abbot's building and never coming out for the world. Oh god, that tree is blowing a bubble. What? Oh no, never mind. It's your dot. It's the dot I put it in. It looks like the tree was like just kind of snot bubble. Oh, God. The strange animal. Let's let's check out this that guy. That creature doesn't watch out. It's going to choke on Conroy. As have so many others. He's before. so proud of that joke. Yep. <laughs> hmm, hunger them. It doesn't want to give it up, and its teeth look pretty sharp. They look pretty blunt, actually. All right, what you you oh, play with the the mouse up there, tumble mouse above you. That? Hey, buddy. Hey, little guy. He's watching me. Oh. Too high. His arm broke when he tried to grab yeah, it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, a hollow. What's in there? Hmm. Nothing. <laughs> well, oh. thanks. We could probably put something in there. A helmet. Oh. I like. Well, looks more like a funnel. Oh. That's what she meant by helmet. What? Okay, we got a helmet and a feather. Anything in the debris? Oh gosh, even the splitters are shattered. Nothing's useful. Really? Okay. Skid marks. Oh. Wow, it's a wonder we survived. Well, take that thorn. I won't rummage around in the dirt. That is thorn bush. That looks like something a useful. Conroy had many of these on his windowsill. What? He was growing thorn bushes? Sure. Ouch. A very affectionate bush. Oh, wait, no. The opposite of that. <laughs> I like this music. Yeah, it's very, very percussive. Yeah. Oh, these traps. Hmm, all these traps are leading me to suspect that there's something behind them I definitely want. Ah, oh, that makes a lot of sense. I hadn't thought about that. I could cross it, but then I'd be dead. Hmm, or caught in traps anyway. I like the sign so much. Tree fruits. <laughs> Trespassers will they be shot. Thank you for solid. understanding. Maybe I shouldn't stand directly beneath the tree. Or maybe you should do exactly that. They're hanging too high up. What? I don't know, there's one right in front of you. Huge fruits are hanging up there. If I kick it now, a fruit will definitely fall on my head. Okay. Uh, use. Ah. Oh. looks stupid. <laughs> There's so many teenagers have thought the exact same thing. That... Hey, great. ...kind of worked. What now? Huh. That didn't actually do what I thought it would. No, now is no time to fool around. So the funnel didn't quite do what we wanted. That's weird. We got to knock it down, but it just didn't... We're right. protected, but the funnel also broke it. Look at the swamp. Okay. Smells like a slug that someone stepped on and then left in the sun. Oh, I can taste that description. Delicious. Now's not the time for a bath. <laughs> uh-huh. Or ever. Oh yeah, the sign. Intruders will be shot. 
thank you for your understanding. They're nailed down, and in fine print it says <laughs> it's forbidden to remove signs. That's a good point. Now you're obeying the laws after everything. They're nailed down. Attention. Dangerous traps. Uh -huh. That's not what mm -hmm. that says. <laughs> oh. Tumble mouse. Oh, you can't interact when it does that? No. Oh, okay. that's like an options thing up there. These little eyes up there. Can we go to this other place? Or are we stuck on this one screen? Oh, yeah, figure it out. Yeah, we are stuck here. Can we do anything with this? Uh... Hmm. Come on. Spit that old liar Have a feather. Oh! He's smart. <laughs> There are only so many things to interact with other things. Oh. Well, awesome. Someone should keep an eye on you. <laughs> Gross. Can we combine I them? Do that. No. Oh, that's clever though. That's a good idea, I think. Okay. Can you use the puppet in the tree hole? That won't work. Okay. <laughs> I thought it might. That's just a run. Hmm. I was hoping I could set something down for something to land on. Yeah, I get what you're trying to do. Uh, Safety looks stupid. What? Nothing to say. Just gonna kick the tree again. Huge. Even though it's probably going to do the exact same thing. Yep. So it just breaks. Yeah. Hey, great. Well, you have what the no? helmet on. Maybe you could use it for something else. No, you, you you probably have to do that. So, what are you? Oh. Doing? Hello, my little. Can I pet you? Hello, you oh. oh. The answer to your first question is, Oi. I was not really expecting the him to talk. To your second question is, no, not unless you wish to do a I also was not expecting him to oh, talk like a pirate. I'm sorry. I had no idea you were able to talk. That makes all no of us. Problem. Not many know I can. Most of the people who ever got to know me are dead. Actually, all of them are. <laughs> um, you should know that 96% of my body consists of lethal poisons. Oh my god. Yes. I live safeguarded, but one becomes a bit lonely after a while. Um, alright. Let's talk about danger. That sounds like a good topic. So, um, would you describe yourself That's a dumb question. Poisonous. It's the primary self-defense mechanism of my species. Okay. Gotcha. So, you can survive in the root forest, even though it's so dangerous. <laughs> to speak the truth here, what makes the root forest so dangerous is the corpse. Oh. But what is so dangerous about you? In principle, everything. I secrete a deadly corrosive fluid. Oh. My tail is a club of death. Ugh. Don't even get me started about my claws. All four of them. They can sink into anything softer than diamond. Hmm. Boy, Which is everything. Forever. Okay, oh, alright. you have your claws? I'll take them. What's so dangerous about your claws? Well, let me put it like this. Actually, I can only move on sturdy rocks. On any other surface, I <laughs> get stuck. Because my claws dig in. With time, this stone will also give way. I imagine that must be very exhausting. Ah, oh, it's not that bad. It keeps me fit. What? Does it? Does it really? Secretion. What exactly is a secretion? Not enough games where I get to talk about secretion. <laughs> not enough. You'd like more? Secret. Yeah. For example, my skin and my saliva are extremely corrosive. Mm -hmm. Which means? That means that when it rains, I don't get wet. Uh, because the water evaporates off of me in about a split second. So, do you need well, to also drink spit water? A hole into this stone pretty easily. That sounds incredibly impressive. Oh, yes, it is. Huh. I once impressed a girl so much that she actually went out on a date with me. 
That probably Have ended badly. Actually, quite well. But when I get nervous, I tend to splutter. Oh, and how did she? <laughs> she melted. Oh, ah. she completely dissolved. <laughs> dark, dark, <laughs> get it? Dark humor. <laughs> Take a step back, Robert. Did you set up these traps here? Why would I do that? I'm a lethal creature all on my own. But who else could have done it? Oh, that was a crazy old man who lives here in the forest. Oh, oh that guy. For a holy man, he exhibits an exceptional creativity. Uh, a holy man? Is this going to be our third wonders. monk? A holy man? Does that yeah. mean he's a wind monk? A uh, former wind monk. His fountain dried up. Mm. But, like all of them. I suspect he still hasn't gotten over it. So, no, we would know who it is then. Weren't there only like four of them? So there are three. Oh, there are three. We've already met two. Speaking. Yeah. Sounds highly impractical. There's one for each fountain. Uh, now, you try meeting ladies as a gorf. Are female gorfs as hazardous as males? Nah, the problem is that they're far more poisonous. Uh. If two gorfs fall in love, they really intend to spend the rest of their lives together. How romantic. Yes, well, the rest of their lives is particularly <laughs> long. <laughs> oh no. Your claws really are sharp. Just looking at them makes my eyes tear up. Yes, and they're impractical. You can't imagine what happens when I have to scratch myself. Ouch. No, oh, yes, without intending anything of the sort. I cut my own oh. flesh oh. and start bleeding. Whoa. Graphic. You want to know the damage my blood can do? Is it like the alien yeah, from Aliens? I really don't think I want. I feel to like know. this glorf would be better served just not existing. Use something to my helmet. I don't need a helmet. Uh, <laughs> Everyone who comes across me does. Oh. Oh, his claws. Oh. Why should I make holes in it? What? Oh, that's a genius idea. Why should you? Because we want you to. Why should I make holes in it? Why do I want... <laughs> make holes in everything. That's funny. Hmm. So... Do you still need that? I don't know yet. And I let it be. We need to be able to put holes in something, clearly. Well, I could. But what? Why should I do? What indeed? Do the traps have a, a thing on them at all? Well, why don't you put something in the trap? Like Connery. I could cross it, but... That won't help me with the... That won't help me. Huh. I think you'd be able to set off the traps. Yeah, I thought maybe he'd want to. But perhaps not. You can't, can you put the helmet in that hole in the tree? I can't Negative. No. It looks like it would fit with the pointy thing. It does kind of look like that. Okay, what else what else can we interact with? The signs are bolted down. Can we get yeah. them out with the helmet? No, they're nailed down and besides there's a sign telling us not to. Oh, so he doesn't want to do it. No. Okay. Can we use Conrad on the thorn bush? Pick yeah, up he, the didn't, thorn? he didn't want to. He didn't want to? No. Okay. And we can't catch the mouse in our helmet? <laughs> I don't think that will work. I think it'd work. I think Robert is too pessimistic. Hey, tumble, mouse. I know. Hey, I want to grab it. It's adorable. What are we missing? Hello, Mr. Go. Hello, young friend. Okay, I guess. I need your help again. With pleasure. Okay. Maybe we just need to talk to him enough. Otherwise, they... Yes, um... Uh, yeah. With those claws, you can't touch anything. Oh, I can indeed touch things. I simply can't do it without killing them. Yeah. Why does he set up traps? Does he not want to be found? Oh, who knows what a crazy last soul <laughs> wants. Tell him to meet last this guy. I saw him. He was blabbering about some secret place in the forest that he has to protect. Hmm. 
That's where we want to go. Super. Now we only have to get past these traps. Well, good luck then. You might as well try to kiss a gorf. <laughs> Not very well disguised no, traps. Honestly, yeah. Nobody has ever kissed me before, you know. Uh. Uh. Hmm. Uh. Uh, uh. The trap system doesn't seem to be very sophisticated. Yes, thank you. That's what yes. I was saying. Indeed. But the crazy old man who set them up is an advocate of efficiency. I see. So they're not clever, but fatal. Okay. Just like you, huh? So <laughs> dangerous. dangerous is the wrong word. That would imply that you could actually survive my touch. I would describe myself as 100% lethal. What does he eat? Really? Yeah, seriously. High five. <laughs> no, just kidding. Uh, okay, so talking to him didn't do anything. Nope. Didn't accomplish a darn thing. Okay, so we can't put Conroy or the helmet in the thing. We can't combine them still? I can't do that. And nope. that vice versa. What? Nothing to say. I can put so on the helmet. Looks stupid. Yeah. So you can put this on. Maybe something from here has to be done besides talk to the dwarf. You want to talk all the way No, outside? that's not gonna change anything. Okay. Hello. What? Yeah, you're right. Okay. Um, can we play with the debris at all? We have the helmet on. The debris. Yeah. My gosh, even no, the split. This is our crash thing. Okay. Yes, yeah, same, same old junk. And the thorns, you can't interact with them with the sun in any real way. No. I don't think I need the helmet. You don't? Okay. Ouch! Okay. Maybe we can use this. At least you're good for something. What? I thought we tried that. No, we tried it with the helmet. Ouch. Wait, how did the puppet. No, that there was ouch. Uh, uh, also, he's full of spines now. What? Okay. So that's now we have a branch. Can we use that on on Gorf? It won't work. Huh? But if you want to break it, go ahead and try it. Hmm. Can you use the branch on the trap? Doubtful. That won't help me no. with the trap problem. So, oh. trap set up. Let <gasps> the tumble mouse come. Oh, we're going we're to catch the tumble mouse. Catch the tumble. Oh, the tumble, and, tumble mouse. And we're going to put that on our helmet? Let's see how long it will hold out. Uh, oh my god! Oh no! I mean, all according to plan. Oh my god, it's so cute. Time to kill it. Oh my god. We now have a tumble mouse. Combine it with your helmet. Hold on tight. Yes. Wow. <laughs> We've got a tumble helmet. Oh, we killed it. It's so <laughs> It it's does kind of look like we impaled it on the helmet. Oh, well, I guess you can get the fruit now. Fan. Oh looks stupid. God. Even. I hope Laura won't see me. Say she looks stupid and also gruesome. All right, tree. Now the mouse is dead. If it wasn't before. <laughs> yeah. Brave helmet. You've done your duty. The helmet. The mouse was brave. Ugh, Robert. So we've discarded the helmet, I guess. What do we do with the nut? See if he wants to eat it. I don't want to beat him to death. Oh, I guess. Very considerate of you. I guess it does work on the trap then. I'm not sure what else to use it on. Oh, really? <laughs> Not. Darn it, it's I noticed in that I can't throw it. He wasn't wearing the sock when he threw it. By the way. Oh really? Yeah, in that animation. I don't think that will work. Okay, so he couldn't throw so it. So that seems to be the right can kind of use idea. It, use it on the branch. Maybe you can bounce it. You know what I mean? Which branch? The thorn branch. Use it like you. I can't interact with it anymore. Oh, you can't do anything with it. No. Oh, that's silly. 
Why should I do that? Oh, he put it in the swamp and it'll bounce out. That seems like a good way to lose our nut. Why should I do that? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. We gotta get what? this guy to help us. He's on his claws at all? Oh, that. We have to make a bowling ball out of it. Ah, of course. Ha <laughs> ha! See? His nose is different. Yeah, that, yeah, that's happened on all of these cutscenes. Yeah. Now that we have a bowling ball, we're totally good for this. Yeah. Robert's a bowling champion. Wow, that was awesome. <laughs> I showed those traps. Good job. Good job, showed Robert. Showed them my mad bowling skills. Oh, there were other traps. Ah, his face. <laughs> pa <laughs> parents are responsible. Is there an explanation? Um, I disarmed the traps. Did you? <laughs> Bye. Laura cares not. I guess she cares a little. Aw, Tumble Mouse. <laughs> Still going up. Who's there? Oh, yay. I just wanted. You're a wind monk. You're wearing Wind Guardian's red. Yes. This fabric conceals bloodstains. Oh. Uh. Please, don't kill me. I didn't intend to break your trap. Answer truthfully. Are you a threat to the secrets of the root forest? No, I'm not dangerous. I'm the opposite. I'm undangerous. Um, <laughs> I'm really lame. Me. Look at this dead postman over here. I hate yeah. that rotten, devious, treacherous dwarf. If I ever meet that slippery, detestable, naked mole rat again, <gasps> I'll kick his wrinkled ass until he can wear himself as a hat. Whoa, that's what? quite no, the trick. I don't know him. I've never heard of him before. Well, I, I used to be his apprentice a long time ago, but that was probably more than an hour ago. Ah! You'll talk sooner or later. <laughs> You're talking now! Who knows? Don't worry. I'll get you down. <laughs> uh, like his giant ear thing. Uh, not so good with the aim. What was that? Alive? Okay, yes, alive. Oh, all right. As long as Robert is trapped, you will play as Lara. Oh, awesome. Let's just go finish the game with her. Bye-bye, Robert. What do we have? A small box. My chili drops are empty. Chili drops? No more chili drops. No more chili drops. <laughs> it's stuck. All right. What can we interact with? We could climb the tree, probably. In order to get up there, I'd need help. Can you climb on the arrow? I bet we need more of them. S screaming ant nest. Um. What? Scream ants. Huh. Seems to be uninhabited. Good. I don't want to destroy it. Screaming ants sound bad. Sounds bad. Home. He has a neck pouch. Of the scream ants. No wonder he's dead. What? 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 Can you leave? I can't can. go into the forest. I think we have hey, haven't exhausted our options Robert. yet. Here, Laura. Man, I'm glad you're here. I can't feel my legs anymore. Hmm. Oh. That does make him shoot. I was hoping it would make more what arrows appear. Only to myself. <laughs> Hello, Robert. How are you? Please don't kill us. I have to get him down from there. I guess... Blue Nose is slowly going crazy. You probably can go into the forest and find things to help with this. Let's look around. I think we have to get rid of that ear trumpet. It seems to be hard of hearing. That thing actually belongs to a record player. <laughs> I hate wind monks. Monks. All of the monks. I hate wind monks. Me too. Yeah, don't worry about he's it, got, Laura. He's, he's got these numbers. I bet he's killed six people. Clothesline. Let's see what we can do with it. Uh, uh, probably nothing from here. I can't reach it. That's but... what I thought. Thanks. The hook is suspiciously close to the rope. I wonder if you talk to him a bunch of it, it'll just break the rope. But that seems like a bad thing. 
Yeah. Like it will potentially kill Robert. That does seem bad. Let's explore into the forest. Let's see yeah. what's down here. I think we should just go on an adventure without Robert. I think it's our chance. We're free at last. The little squirt's gone. So there's more deep into the forest. There's a reed. Ooh. Which seems useful to me. Yes. Yeah, a reed. Reeds are good. Watch your limbs. We are not liable for lost extremities. <laughs> Let's see what's over here. An adventure, an adventure. Adventure in the forest. Whoa. Oh. Hello, gents. This is weird. I see a screaming ants. Oh, screaming ants. What's that screaming all the time? We know. If I can't see it. It has to be really small. Like an ant. <laughs> We've already established that these things exist. What should I grab? I can't see. But I could just start stomping all over the ground. But Laura. If it doesn't stop screaming, that's what I'll do. You sociopath. Put the reed in there. Yeah. Uh, no. It was a great idea, Laura. Shut up. Shut up. Alright, well, we can probably take some stuff here. Oh, man. All these guys. Strange guys. They are pretty strange. The machine. Oh, yeah, I don't even know. I don't even know where to start. There's so many things. The machine is aiming at that strange animal on the edge of the forest. Which. Oh! Our Glorf. They want to kill him. Now it's aiming at the crazy old <gasps> man in the treehouse. Oh, my God. Are you going to. Exactly what I thought. Nothing. The tank is full of honey. Oh my god. A red button connected to the machine. Uh -huh. I have the urge to press it and see what will happen. I like. I like button. I press button. It doesn't do anything. Uh, it's busted. No! It. That's clearly a thing. We have a wind map, we have a tent. Well, let's see what these strange guys are all about. A wind map is a strange concept. Mapping but the wind. In its own weird way, it sort of makes sense. True, true. All right, guys. What kind of characters are you then? Where are you doing? 